Good morning. We're so happy you're here. We daily vlog. So if you like this video, we hope you come back tomorrow. I'm actually running a little tardy to my appointment, my checkup with my midwives after having Teddy. Um, and I just wanted to commemorate this moment because it was the first time in my full pregnancy, nine months and now eight weeks later, that I didn't need directions to get to this office in Wilmette. Um, so I'm gonna go in. Thanks, Jen, for leaving this pretty mask in my car when you picked us up from the airport. So everything went well, really uneventful, very quick appointment, which was great. Um, but funny enough, I needed directions to get home. It's not the exact same way to get home. And I know that my directions have taken me a bunch of different ways. And I don't remember, so I was all excited about not using maps today, but I gotta do it for the way home. Me and Jamesy are playing some trains. I'm home now. Should we have a smoothie? <laughs> We're on a little stroll. We picked up some croissants from a nearby French bakery. James loves these Patron murals at Progress Bar. They're so beautiful. I look a fright, but we're happy to be outside. Happy to get fresh air. And James is still a little too, like, let's be honest, like snotty to be going to the park. So we went on, like, a decent walk and we got Teddy here too this is just his protection from the Sun it's actually pretty shady but it's nearing the time where there's no shade um, we're trying to like bump up his nap not the actual nap itself but just like the process of getting him down because we aren't doing bottles anymore um, so we want to get our walk in early what happens when you get up to just grab a cup of water while you're working your puppy comes in and just snatches your spot but how can I deny her with that cute face and those cute paws? Look at this kid just hanging out in the window. Denying nap time. He asked to be like, brought me to the door to like go outside. So I was like, let's just sit in the window. Teddy's napping like a champ. Yeah, I think I'm going to take my lunch. I think I'm going to take my lunch now and go on a lunchtime run. And we'll, James will come with in the stroller. <laughs> we'll see if that knocks him out. <laughs> Look at this beautiful day out. Not a cloud in the sky. I mean, a little hazy by downtown, but that's what happens. Fell asleep literally like a block away from our apartment. Doing a quick 5K. I'll just say it. I love Florida. I love Chicago. You guys know both of these to be true. But at one thing I will say. You will never feel this good when it's 85 degrees out running in Florida. Because somehow it's 85. It's probably not true 85 right where I am because I'm getting a breeze off the lake, but feels good. All right, day two back to running. Slow and steady, that's what I'm doing. Getting my aerobic base back by just staying consistent. Default mileage is three miles a run. I don't think I'm gonna go past six for maybe a month and a half. We'll see, we'll see. This is my very sleepy baby. He looks just like his older brother, who's also a sleepy baby. Do you want your binky? So I just finished editing the vlog, like our 
I don't even know what kind of vlog with the Disney footage. I put in some throwback clips from our week being sick and then yesterday. And the tough part is about the Disney footage was that we vlog primarily on the camera. And so it's great that we had the cell phone footage, but like some of it didn't make sense. So I didn't include it all. It's a little confusing. I'm having hope. I want to keep this footage. And if we get the camera back, I'll put up full vlogs of those days just in the future. Um, but hopefully at least something is, is better than nothing. We have me going on Cosmic Rewind and a couple of other sweet moments. But if you have any questions or if it's confusing, just leave a comment or message and hopefully I'll be able to clarify. Peter put on Greatest Showman. Teddy is awake after his three hour nap. I'm just hoping he's healing. Oh, you're gonna lift your, you're gonna just hold your head up? Big kid. Look at this comfy girl too. Guys, we have to sanitize everything, like all of our toys. And I feel like we're just gonna be finding snot in random places forever. Jamesy and I have been playing with water. We got whisks, we got all sorts of stuff to play with. And like putting them in different containers, it's been really fun today. You hooking us up with pineapple? That's all you got. What? Leftover pasta. It doesn't look that appetizing, oh, but it, it, does. it smells delicious. good. Just a kid and some rubbish cube walking down the street to Chicago <laughs> in his pajamas. I, I literally fell out the window that it was cool out. It is not cool out. What Sarah might have not realized, though, is the fan was on when she was at the window. I thought it was chilly, and I put socks and pants on to me. Changed him into. I put even him for myself. At least the sun's not out, really. That's true. It's got hot skies. Also, the dude at the French Cafe gave it exactly. It's not a standard three by three, but it's, it's not, still it's cool. Not even like, I don't know what it is. James is liking it so far. I don't know the last time I heard the term cotton candy skies. If ever. <laughs> but yeah, I get it. It makes sense to me. Oh my gosh. Honestly, Sarah and I were just talking about yesterday how like fleeting the Chicago oh, oh. the Chicago summer has been because we were in Chicago or Florida and then sick. Did you see it light up? But there's lightning bugs out. <gasps> I feel like I still haven't seen. Wow. This is probably the first time in his like recognizable human life that he has seen lightning bugs. We're trying to, we're, we're going for a walk. We might go to park and play. The park we go, we're heading towards is towards Christine and Grant's old apartment. And there's a field, and when there's a field, hey, I feel like I even, I feel like I even, we haven't seen lightning bugs either. Cause we, we were like busy last summer too with your mom being sick and then travels as well. Like you don't have lightning bugs in, in the South. Yeah. We yes. saw Oh, Mama found a big leaf on the ground for James to play with. It's huge. It's like the size of his big head. <laughs> James is exploring the park with Sarah. Got a bunch of youths. I think they're actually like adults over there playing adult soccer. The hope was to go on a nice hot walk so James could tire himself out and go back to sleep because he just woke up from a very late nap. Ayo, climb that mountain, Jamesy, climb it. Whoa. Teddy is cozy and asleep. Look at that. Nice. I have his binky if it needs it. I see a really nice big sunflower. I'm gonna go check out. So this is a fun, like, not super common. Chicago Park District has, has hundreds. I think they have something like six or 700 parks in the city of Chicago. This park, like this playground, is technically Chicago Park District after four o'clock. Before that, it's the it's the schools, so that's kind of cool, right? Um, so like you can the kid the school gets the schools the school children get to play here on recess, and then afterwards after the after school events and everything, it is public space. Look at this flower! Look at this little garden. 
going on. Love it. Oh, these are a bunch of sunflowers. Getting ready. Is that corn? I don't know, no vegetation. Yeah, getting ready. Told, we were saying that summer's going away and I feel like sunflowers are a big thing in the fall, so get ready. Wait a minute. Are you gonna go to the slide? I can't fit with him, so he's gonna try his by himself. See him on my hand? You gotta stay on your bottom. <gasps> Yay! Oh gosh, was that fun <laughs> or what? Watch, watch mommy go down. <laughs> so silly. I feel so lucky we fought in a park with not a lot of kids so we could play. But now we definitely have to change your jammies. We got superhero James over here. <laughs> I don't, honestly, I don't even know what those cups are for. I think they're like cones. They're like wannabe cones? Yeah. Well, they're now his like source of power. Yay! <laughs> I gotta hang on to you, gonna fall. <laughs> All right, get ready. <laughs> that was great. Now run up it. What are you laughing at? We just missed cars. We'll have to come back for Encanto. Yeah. Because tomorrow Encanto's playing at Millennium Park. But we can't go because Peter's part of the American Cancer Society panel. So let's go this way. <laughs> I, oh, I thought he was flipping the bird, but it was, it was, it was ring finger. He's wide awake. This knows that the hardest time <laughs> filming this clip. You guys tell we haven't been vlogging in a week. I'll, I'll put the clip in. I blinded him with the flashlight, or with the flash. He's just wide awake. Of course, when we should be going to bed, we've got resort TV on, and we're making a track. This really is Jamesy's favorite thing to do these days. Whoa. Maybe close to 10 o'clock. Definitely have Must Do Disney on, the new one, not Stacy, because that breaks our heart too much. We're playing while dad gets the room ready for bedtime. I really have no shame in how I'm looking these days, putting myself on the internet. Um, but I have Teddy in the bathroom doing a steam shower. I'm nervous he's wheezing. And that was one of the things the doctor said to like bring him back if that happens. Truly, he's been sleeping so much. I feel like he's coughing less now that this little tidbit is happening. I'm just a little concerned. The anxiety is a little heightened, but I, I didn't do a steam shower in the morning like I have been, so I mean, maybe it just goes to show how important they are. Like, they're really all the doctor said we can do. Plus sucking stuff from his nose and saying whatnot, but that's like as it happens. You're really cute. Like, really, really cute. Just our communal roll of toilet paper on the table. So sleepy. James went down great. It's good to be home. Not yet? We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>